Hello and welcome to the p and &E Home Exercise Series. My name's Dr Tom Little. Uh, today I thought it was going to be our Leicester episode because the lads were due back in to start training on Saturday but last time we found out that's not going to be the case and unfortunately we're not back until the 25th so we might be able to squeeze in one more but with in mind that I thought it was going to be the last show I thought I'd do a little bit of combination of different circuits that we've been doing throughout the series so we can take the learnings that we've done before to do a great mix up circuit. So today you're going to need a football or any type of ball you're going to need an elevated surface and then you just need a little bit of space around you but not too much to do the power based exercises at the end so as we've normally been doing we're going to work for 20 seconds and then rest 20 seconds during the rest period i'm going to show you how to do the next exercise and we'll just cycle through so we'll start with the football onto the elevated surface then onto a little bit of functional tums and bums and then finishing with a, a bit of power exercise so I'll just get ready to start so our first exercise is just a nice easy squat good warm-up exercise with the ball in front to keep our back up right so starting in three have both side on just for demoing and go 20 seconds so keeping the heels down the back up right the knees tracking over the toes so we turn around and we're over halfway last few and rest up next exercise is a push-up exercise so we're going to do the three different levels of difficulty on offer so you can just do a normal push-up where your chest go into the ball we can do 10 seconds where our hands are on the ball and then we'll swap after 10 or we're going to swap sides with a little jump like that so i'll demo the last one and we're off halfway to so swap arms if you're doing the one arm one last couple and we're done okay next exercise still need the ball so we're doing a bridge while we're squeezing the ball so the ball's between our knees squeezing really hard all the time with our knees and then we're just doing bridges up to straight and back and go Remember, keep squeezing the ball all the time. So we're working our groin area. At the same time, we're engaging our backside muscle. It's over halfway. Excellent, well done. Next exercise, we're doing leg flutters. So it's core exercise. The technique, if you can do it, is looping it under your leg. If you can't do that, just hold the ball and you're just doing little leg flutters in a V shape. We want the chest out, keeping the back nice and straight, and we're off. Remember, if you can't do that, we're just here, and we're fluttering the legs. That's over halfway. Three, two, and one. Okay, that's the ball done with now. We're on to our elevated exercises. So the first one, we're just doing on one leg. We're squatting back onto our elevated surface and then back up. Okay, if you're struggling with one leg, just do a two leg one. And that's us starting. I'll shout us to change leg after 10 seconds. That's halfway, so swap legs. Three, two, and last one to get down. Okay, we're gonna do dips now. So, difficult level tees on the dips in terms of how hard you're doing. If you want it fairly easy, you want your legs close here. Harder, the legs are out, and then advanced, one leg in the air. Okay, so I'll call after 10 seconds if there's one leg in the air. So that's us off. Try and get nice and deep. And swap sides.
And that time, excellent, well done. Okay, and my favorite exercise, rear foot elevated squat. So we're just putting our foot, back foot on there, weights on the front foot, and then we're looking to lunge down in this position. Keep the trunk nice and upright, 10 seconds each leg. That's us, go. Swap sides. One more and rest there. Okay, so we're on to push up exercise now. So the push up two levels of difficulty. Easier would be in this position, and we're just doing push ups there. So there's less gravity, more advanced. Our feet are elevated, and we're doing a push up from this position. And ready, steady, go. Try and keep your back nice and straight by tucking your bum under. Tense your bum up. Go over halfway. Excellent, well done. Next exercise, we're actually moving on to our functional tums and bums now, but we're going to use the elevated for surface just to start off with. So we're going to do mountain climbers. So we're in a nice push up position again. Just picking one leg up, hold it for about a second and then go with the other leg. Okay, and begin. Halfway, keep that nice straight line, the chest out, the bum's tensed up, so your tail's under. Two, and one, excellent. We can get rid of the elevated surface now. So the next exercise we're working on the side of our core. So we're going to do two exercises back to back for 10 seconds. So we're in a side bridge position, we're going to dip for 10. Then we're going to twist that top elbow for 10. We'll do that each side, okay? First 10 seconds, let's go. That's halfway, so we want to twist now. two and one and rest and we're just going to work that pattern on the other side now so if you feel a little bit more advanced you could go straight away on the other side if you're doing your own timing but we're gonna to have to wait for the rest so get ready to set up on this side remember it's dips then twist yep we're in your position let's go with our dips Halfway, twists. And time, excellent, well done. The last one for our tums and bums now before we finish with the power. We're doing one leg cut bridge, okay? So we're just doing a bridge, but we're pushing into our other leg that's free. So this leg's on the ground, I'm pushing up to straight, while I'm always pushing against this leg, so I'm actively going like that with my free leg and pushing against it. 10 seconds each side. And begin. Good, swap sides. And rest there. Okay, we're on to the final bit now. Final push, so we're doing our power exercises. So get ready for a little breathe on. So our first one, we're doing a burpees into a long jump and then a high jump. So I'll be down, up, jump across, and then jump in the air, and then I'm twisting to do my burpees again. Okay, get ready to go. Two, one, we're off. Over halfway. That's 
time. Okay, so two exercises left. We're on to a core power exercise now. So we're doing mountain climbers for 10 and then side kicks for 10. So our mountain climbers look like that. We're gonna do fast ones for power. Then side kicks, you're just bringing your far leg across and kicking out, we're doing it at a good pace. Ready, steady, go. So mountain climbers. Good, that's halfway into our side kicks for 10. And time, okay, last exercise. So these are get ups into little sprints and then a back shuffle. So, in this position, we're up quickly, little sprint, and then back jockey in, and then we back down. Last one, so make sure you're putting it in. Ready, steady, let's go. That's halfway. Keep putting that max power in. Last couple. One more for good luck. And we're done. Okay, so hope you enjoyed that one. Might be able to sneak in one more circuit next week, so I'll look out for you then. Stay at home, stay safe, and see you next week, hopefully.